everyone. We are about to get everything started. It's a preciously short piece of time. To beat climate change, we need decisive and exponential action. Every one of us uses 34 kilograms of stuff every day. And of that 34 kilograms, 31 kilograms is wasted. Steel, cement, plastics, aluminium, they make up more or less 20% of carbon emissions in the world. Notoriously, you know, the, the fashion industry is overproducing. So a third of what is produced is never sold. In a city like Nairobi, the traffic is unbelievable and the rate of car growth is also unbelievable. Nine of the known 15 tipping elements that regulate the stability of your system are on the move. The use of materials are really at the root cause of so many sustainability issues. I will encourage every company, every financial institution to join the Race to Zero, the UN Race to Zero, immediately. What's been really extraordinary in the last year is to see companies in what we would call hard to abate sectors committing to these kinds of goals. The dioxide problem is a possibility if you understand the business dynamics that are now evolving around the world. That is almost equivalent to five times the volume of water that passes through Niagara Fall each year. We have halved our own emissions between 2012 and 2017 and are now at the 70% reduction in nine years. If everyone in the United States was to use their phone for just a year longer, it would be the equivalent of taking 600,000 vehicles off the road. Cars are the most inefficient use of space in these dense urban areas for moving humans. So a circular economy. We have to move from a linear system to a circular one. Here are enormous opportunities. That is how we change things together. Your opinions will also be a rating on our platform where those business and organizations that are doing good climate action will get a better climate score compared to the ones not doing enough. This is going to change how a corporation competes.